you can see it from the highway so you know exactly where you are. Say hello to Mac the Moose in Moose Jaw. We've reached the final weekend at the Scotties. Four teams remain in the hunt for the title. They include a record holder, three-time champion, and two teams in search of their very first. Krista McCarvel has never stood on the top step of a Scotties podium, but hopes to hear in Moose Jaw. While Rachel Holman has won three times and believes the fourth will happen. The 3-4 game is an all-Ontario battle. And it's next as the Scotties continue. Check your ticket. Thank you very much. And in we go to the concourse level here at Mosaic Place as we head into the final two days of play. Last night was the last draw of the championship pool. We already knew the four teams that would be advancing. This was Northern Ontario playing in the seventh against Team Wildcard, Krista McCarville, Thunder Bay, against Jennifer Jones. Great shot here, quiet, enough to get around the guard and then sit in time, added three as she would go on to the win. A wonderfully curled game and Manitoba by three over Ontario. The other teams closing out play, Saskatchewan goes out on a high, a win over BC and Team Canada, the defending champions, Chelsea Carey close out with a win over PEI. So when the championship pool is all said and done, we knew the four teams as of yesterday afternoon. Here they are, Manitoba, Team Wildcard, Ontario, and Northern Ontario. Setting up now the 1-2 and 3-4 games coming up tonight, 7 p.m. Eastern Time. Manitoba against Team Wildcard, winner to the final tomorrow. Of course, the loser gets that second chance. No second chances, however, for the 3-4 game, which is coming up. And on this Saturday afternoon, we do say hello, Canada, and welcome back to Moose Jaw, continuing coverage of the Scotty Cheryl Russ alongside. So it is Northern Ontario against Ontario. And if you are Rachel Holman from Ottawa, my goodness, you're probably a, still a little shocked about what's happened. I know I was. Uh, nine and one looks so good, so solid all week. Bang, all of a sudden you go from first to third. Right. Now you're sudden death. You don't have two tries to get to the final. You're playing McCarvel for all the marvels here. They have to really park that, and I think they will. If you've won this thing three times like this talented young team from Ontario has, it won't be a problem. I wonder if Northern Ontario has learned anything from that game that they played last night. I think they did. I think they learned that Toman team, they're playing exceptionally well, but I also think what they saw out there was Manitoba pushing early and getting rewarded for it. You're not going to get many mistakes from this team, Holman, but when you may get them is in the first couple ends. So take some risks. You could be rewarded very big and make Holman answer back on some of those really tough shots. So that is our game. No second chances for these teams. You win, you move on. Here at the Scotties, north against the south. Northern Ontario, Ontario coming up. To win any Scotties title, I think I probably want this one the most. And the reasoning is because Thunder Bay is hosting the Scotties next year. And I think to be back and be representing Team Canada would be pretty amazing. I think for us it's mostly uh, we want to win every game we're in and we want to see how far we can go in the sport and we want to represent Canada and we're uh, excited to get the chance to maybe put that maple leaf on our backs. The Scotties Tournament of Hearts is brought to you by Tim Hortons, the official coffee of Curling Canada. The Scotties Tournament of Hearts is brought to you by OK Tire and BKT Tires. By Scotties, Canada's number one tissue. And by New Holland, proud sponsor of Curling Canada. Well, this is deja vu all over again. A rematch of last year's 3-4 page playoff. The North against the South. Time to meet the teams now. And is brought to you by Home Hardware. Here's how. Team Ontario. They are from the Ottawa Curling Club. Rachel Holman, 
with Lisa Weagle, Joanne Courtney, and Emma Miskew. The Northern Ontario champions out of Thunder Bay in the Fort William Curling Club with Krista McCarvel making an eighth appearance at the Scotties with Jen Gates, Ashley Sipola, and Kendra Lilly. Ontario at nine and two, Northern Ontario eight and three, so by virtue of that better record, Ontario gets their choice. They're taking the Red Stones, and they are also getting the last rock. So Northern Ontario will throw the yellow. Krista McCarvel is out. One last good luck to a passing Rachel Holman. Has the rush down just inside the, uh, or midway through in the 12. And to get his own underway, the Northern Ontario lead is Jen Gates. Well, we talked a little bit in the opening about the game last night with uh, Ontario and Manitoba, but the difference, and, and Manitoba pushed really early and they were rewarded with it, but they also had the hammer to start. Mm -hmm. So for Northern Ontario, they're going to have to figure out how to get out of this situation, you know, with the least amount of damage possible and get the hammer back. Yeah, Holman's just been incredible at finding a way to score twos, and, and it just seems easy. Like, they did just seem to get so many twos. Yeah, one of the highest uh, hammer conversion rates in the field, their ability to score two or more. Oh, it's extra. Stay close. No. Um. I'm sure they have a game plan, but with that stone back edge of the eight, uh, I think I may be a little surprised. I would expect maybe Holman to be a little bit more aggressive and then can't hold the shooter. They may have put up the corner, but they like to play the hit. Let's take a look at the keys to the game, and we will start with Northern Ontario. Well, you talk about the other 15%. Your team may be playing 85% out there, but don't stop there. It's how you manage that other 15%. It's your shot tolerance. It's the brushing. It's what you do for your teammates. And then forced to be reckoned with, we talked about it. Ontario is scoring almost nine points a game. It's unbelievable. So you have to use the force without a lot of risk to be able to shut that scoring down and then get the hammer back. Try, mine's good. And Jen Gates much better this time. Keeps it in front of the T-line. Now the uh, keys for Rachel Holman and Ontario. Well, Force McCarvel, uh, we've talked all week how great Krista McCarvel is. And she makes so many shots. So th it's just simple. You have to create some difficulty for the Northern Ontario skip. And all in. If you look at the stats, all four Ontario players are ahead. Three, four, up to 7% above Northern Ontario. So you've got all those tools in the tool bag. Use them. Be aggressive. Uh, keep applying pressure. Keys to the game are brought to you by Cashmere Bathroom Tissue. Nothing feels like cashmere. They did that in the round robin game too, Cheryl. 9-4 win by Ontario over Northern Ontario. And we watched a bit of that game from the, uh, it was beside our TV game. And they, they stayed very aggressive early Ontario and it seemed to work. Well, if you nice handicap, I think you look at the handicap, these two teams and, you know, championship wins and the experience in Olympics, it goes definitely to Holman's team. So what do you do to counter that if you're Northern Ontario? What risks can you take within reason? I think it's cautiously aggressive. You don't have to, you know, go all out, but you do have to take some risks against some exceptional teams. Are you a little surprised when Gates first stone from Northern Ontario goes back edge of the eight and the corner doesn't go up from Ontario? You know, I'm not. What I have seen this year with Holman is there's times they'll throw the corner and there's times they revert back to what we saw for so many years and that was to play out a blank in the first end. So I, I think they don't play by road as much anymore. They, they're not as predictable and I think they like to throw the opposition off. So you don't know what's going to come at you. That's part of, part of strategy 101, isn't it? Is try to keep the other skip guessing on what you're thinking about doing. I think that's what uh, McCarvel team, Krista, most certainly thinks their advantage is by not playing on tour all season, is that teams don't know them as well. Yeah, that's very true. And I know that makes me as a skip, I'm sure you, you go mm -hmm. play a team, you know, you know when you play against Glenn that when you do this, he's going to do this. Right. And, and that's comfortable. And right. nobody should go outside of that. They should do exactly yeah. what they're supposed to do. Yeah. But you play somebody you don't know, and Whoa. they throw something back at you, and it, throws, it sets you back right. in your heels. We've seen a lot at the World Play, haven't you, where you're, you're playing uh, Team Korea or something, and they go totally off, off script. <laughs> 
They're like, that's not right. <laughs> this is what you need to do. These two teams have not met on tour this season. And Holman lifetime against McCarville has won five times. Two round robin wins, two playoff wins. Ten. Just ten. Green. Ten. Easy. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, Jen. Go we talked out. about this Green. matchup in the Manitoba Green. Ontario game with the thirds with Kendra Green. and with um, Val Sweeting that that was going to be key and, and it really was mm -hmm. in that game. That was the difference and I think it will be again today. So remember again, it was 16 teams playing in two groups of eight, and uh, there's the uh, record for Ontario. They lost to Suzanne Bird of PEI, and then that last, they go over the championship pool as of Thursday night and in Manitoba. They lost last night. And, and again, as, as we said, wonderfully played. Rachel Holman, I think, was 93%. Two teams were in the 90s as a whole. And it's just that game that drops Holman from first place prior to starting to third place now. And I think you shake that off. I mean, that could really frustrate teams. Play one of the best games ever, and you lose, and you lose a chance in the one versus two, or you can just say, we threw our, one of our best games ever, and right. it didn't go our way. Right. Uh, and you're, you're three games away from your goal. It's not that far. Eight and three, the record for Northern Ontario. In those first seven, you try to space out your losses, and so they did a nice job of that. They lost to Manitoba. Ah, yeah, Nunavut. Congratulations to Laurietti as Nunavut wins two. But you take your two losses over, uh, then they drop the game to Ontario. Now you're in trouble, but then they put three in a row, BC, PEI, and Team Wildcard. So, Good, strong finish for Krista McHarville. Well, and even lesson, Vic, really good bounce back. You, that Nunavut game, you go out there and you think that that's probably a game you should win. They didn't win it. You could really have a letdown. Krista McHarville played 100% the next game against Alberta. <laughs> yeah. That's sending a message. Yeah, the uh, just the fourth player ever in a Scotties to throw uh, the fourth stone and be perfect. Ten, right? Yep. Yeah. That's uh, that Control. stats. Maybe they has an asterisk yeah, yeah. there too because it's a five rock rule. Okay, it's even it's harder to girl 100. percent After the game last night, though, Rachel was standing behind the boards, and the team always gathers with their coach, Marcel Rock, and he was talking to them okay. after Same they way, lost yeah. to Manitoba. Okay. And all you saw on Rachel's was just this blank face, and as if she had just tuned out. I know he was talking. I just don't <laughs> know if she had, was hearing anything because I, she really, I think, was surprised at how well she played, the team played, and they lost that game. Yeah, some you know some of the best players too. I, I think they do a, kind of a self analytics after a game where they go through the shots quickly. You're trying in your mind to find out where it went wrong, where was the mistake. Well, at 93%, there wasn't. I am sure she was searching. It was an early end against a really great hitting team where the three came up and it was just really hard to come back against them. Those are the scary losses, though, because yeah. you, you lose a game and go, ah, I missed the shot in the fifth end, or, you know, uh, we could have played a little better. Or let's, we'll, let's change the strategy up a little so bit. Yeah. You throw a 92 at them and you lose, and you're kind of like, well, now what? 
yeah, it's human nature to always want to know mm -hmm. what, what could I have done better. Right. Sometimes right. you just have to right. say nothing. Yeah. It is curious. Hard. Hard, we are on sheet C, and this is the championship uh, clean, clean. piece of ice now for the weekend. Also, though, keep in mind, they do have an opportunity to, to go and pick some stones from other sheets when you get to the playoffs. We'd like the first. Championship weekend has arrived here in Moose Jaw. Down to the Fab Four. After the Sweet 16, the Great Eight, now down to the Final Four. And this is the three, four page playoff. We'd like the first once again. It'll be Team Ontario, Rachel Holman out of Ottawa that has the last rock. They have the hammer playing the yellow stones. Center line guard goes up, corner followed by Ontario covering the eight. And now right around goes Jen Gates. Lisa Weagle. I really like this call and this stone coming up. Uh, you could freeze to definitely shot stone, but they're going to throw a little bit of weight at it. If you tick off the center guard, fine, but you can get a little bit of a hit roll in off the back one, too. Or roll buried off of this one. Odd options. Oh, oh, oh. Spin back if you can. Really nice. Marcel Rock on the right in his uh, second time around as coach and uh, Cheryl Kreviazek there as the uh, alternate player. They, I think, you know, further to your point, uh, Russ, about how they handle this game mentally, you know, Marcel pointed out they worked with the likes of Adam, Adam Kingsbury and uh, Kyle Paquette, two noted sports psychologists who have worked with them now for a number of years. You would think that it would take hold at some point. Oh, no question about it. This, this is an extremely well coached uh, team that they've reached out to get the right people to just help mold their careers, really. But you wouldn't want to get stuck analyzing it forever. It's it's let's get some sleep. We've got a game to win tomorrow. Rick Lang is the uh, coach of uh, the McCarville team. We'll see him with Brad Jacobs at the Tim Hortons Briar in Kingston. Uh, for him, it a couple of things. This team works hard at it. We talked about McCarville and the effort that she puts in trying to work around as they all do family. Uh, and also then that the third spot Kendra Lilly. So he even says he may have hurt a little bit when she came out of juniors trying to be something that she's not. He's really just unleashed her now, and she's come through with a couple of great 90% games. Uh -huh. and, and you can see instantly when she's playing well. Of course, it goes up the line. Krista gets a better read on the ice. She follows up with a great game. Close the Okay. Two and a half is good. I think also too, you know, in defense of Rick, you come out of juniors, you're trying to prove you belong and you're, you may play a little tighter. And once you get that confidence that, hey, I can play with this league, then you start to really, truly play. It's close to the guard here. Ashley Sipola. Lily Gates sneaked it. Oh, they did. And they'll roll it away. Threw a lot of weight at that shot, which meant uh, to hang around, you had to scare the guard, and they did scare it. That was coming pretty hard. That was almost like 10 seconds. Nice. Almost normal hit weight at that. No. Other way. Yep. Joanne Courtney. Okay, well, well, um, easy. All right, Em, you gotta go. Help it over. And we'll roll it over. And again, tuck a couple of grains underneath the corner. And they're trying to roll that way. As soon as uh, Joanne threw it, they yelled, let's play the audible. And they brushed it to hold it straight. And it turned out it might have curled enough if they hadn't have done that. So here she is, Kendra Lilly. In a... Fourth Scotty's appearance, the four time Northern Ontario Fire! Junior Champion. A little bit more room now past his guard. And rolling again back towards center line to sit two without. Real cat and mouse game here because both teams 
of the respect of each other. And if you don't make the hit and roll, you expect the other guy to make it. So it's a lot of pressure on those shots. This is this call here is how you see Homan's team, you know, use the hammer and convert to a couple. They they will ignore stones. They play the higher percentage shot, which is the draw compared to the hit and roll. I mean, it's risky, but they usually get rewarded for it. Forces the other team to chase. Gotta go wide open. get in there, Courtney. Now Holman out. And they'll drag it to the top eight. And uh, again, half stone around. Shot rock, though, still belongs to Northern Ontario. I've seen Rachel Holman come out more this week than I have only in recent memory to help brush. It, I don't know what it's the reason. If it's if it is maybe to give a break to the likes well, of Weagle or Courtney. I think there's two reasons. That's a, that's one. And then the uh, the front end know they can go heads down as hard as they possibly can, knowing they've got that reprieve at the end. And then Rachel is a a great brusher, and she's in this case as the game wears on, her broom is fresher. She can scratch better as that game wears off because those brooms will they'll uh, calm down as the game goes along. You wear them out a little bit. Yeah, each time before every game, they're all, they'll put on their new pads. Hard! Yeah, hard, 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 oh, hard, and hard, this hard. time, and right up the side. So sitting three without. I think both teams getting fortunate. It's That's coming in straight, that inside out turn. Yes. It just doesn't seem to finish yeah. hard. We talked about that, and that's a tendency in arena ice, isn't it? It mm -hmm. starts off, this shot would, on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, that wrecks all day. It's just that little bit straighter. It's not going to be simple to bury around a tight corner guard. You're going to need a little longer Joe, corners. Joe hard, Joe hard. It's really close. Close. Gotta go, gotta roll. Gotta go hard, roll it hard. Really good. Yeah, or just, yeah. yeah. That is a great on. shot because if you make everything go away, then Rachel's going around that corner guard. You want to save one of these yellows. Does dead on leave a double, Cheryl? But it would be probably close. Not. Yeah, it's going to be very close. I'm going to roll a little bit here. Like an eight. Okay. Here. Um. I think you guys can mm. hold this. No, I think it'd yeah. still be a little too low in the house. Yeah, nose or hair high. Okay. Northern Ontario with one win. Eight. That was Heather Houston whoa, back in whoa. 88. Yes. Then Houston won as whoa. Team Canada the next year. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Should we have straight picked? Sit, sit. And now it needs well, to sit for them. them. Okay. And that will spill. Okay. That gives Rachel the chance. It's all the little things. A beautiful roll by Emma Miskew. Creates a slight error here. Well, and they've had a chance now to see this spot once, so tighten the ice up slightly. Had to brush Emma's from one end to the other, so that might have made a difference too. Try and go easy early. Rachel Holman drawing for a fourth. Scotty's win. Interesting to note, though, each of the wins has come from the 1 2 game. She's never won from the 3 4. Last year, mentioned this is a rematch. And she did get through to the final before losing to Chelsea Carey. So, trying to do something for the first time, win a championship from the 3 4 game. Switch. 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 Five, six. Looks all there. Don't need to. Over there. Down. Seven, eight. eight. No. Got to slow down here. At the okay. end, it should slow, slow down. Jump. There haven't been any rocks there yet. Sorry, so the uh, three wins all come from the one two game and of course the uh, the format changed to the pool play in 18 so this is the third year of pool play and trying to come out of the three four
extra weight uh, was a, it was a like ten and a half, byproduct so of the yeah. previous yeah. shot, Emma's, where they uh, brushed it like all the way as hard as they could and kind of warmed that path up oh, a bit. Joe could have kept going. It might have been dead buried. Yeah, it's just making it easier to have. Back line. Yep. Hard, 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 so, uh, I heard back line, that's why I said go, because yeah. it's going to go off that line, so. Good throw. I thought. Keep those corner guards a hair longer, because it it's takes a bit of time to get the finish, mm -hmm. doesn't it? A little straighter. Like, I actually thought Krista on that last that's one, she, kept, she wasn't that, that typical enough? crisp mm -hmm. to the broom, a little soft, and it still held no problem. And it was slightly more weight than they wanted. This is inside the draw to the button path. He can't go to the draw to the button path because the red rock's in the way. Always a hair slower in number two. She's had pretty good feel this week. It's good. Oh, close. Sure. Running, running. Take Line's a look. Great. No. Line's good. Heads up because they see that guard coming up, waiting for it to finally break away. And here it goes. Good. Nice weight. So forced to the One single back. here in two. Northern Ontario with the last rock when we come back. Well, now on the uh, championship weekend. And this three, four page play if it's very quiet out on the ice. Just the one game here at Mosaic Place. We welcome you back. The winner will move on. The, uh, the loser of this one eliminated from this year's Scotties. Ontario with the single in two means that Northern Ontario and uh, Krista McCarvel of the Thunder Bay have the last run. They have the hammer playing the Yellowstones here in three. But if I get the top, not bad. Yeah. Go here. Oh, I like going I after one like of those. You like it? Yeah, yeah you like that back call. Eight. I'm just letting yeah, you know. Yeah, just back eight. We can't throw anymore. Okay. That's a, yes, that last eight. end's a big check mark for Northern Ontario, Russ, because you think about the fact that how good Homan is with the hammer, mm -hmm. how many points they've been scoring. Your goal would be get out of that with the least amount of damage possible, and they did. They forced. And now you can do something yourself with the hammer. Yeah, the perfect start, really. I like this call, too, but this is a tough yes, shot. Yes, yes, yes. They're trying to tick off either one of them. Hard. We watched uh, Lisa Weagle do it. Hard! Hard! You're on the top one. Keep going. Hard! Hard! You gotta go. Oh boy, you gotta roll it. Over the top one. Hard! Go on the roll. Jen Gates. And we'll raise it in. So they're sitting the two without center line top edge and then full in the 12. Just seemed um, the weight on that one because you're throwing probably down fresh pebble. They hadn't been down there. You usually want about back line. Mm. curl to the middle and a little lust to the corners than what we've watched so far this week. Hit your way to this now. Throw like, throw like an eight. Okay. Cross it a hair. Which turn is this? Out turn. Out. Okay. I thought they wanted in turn. Ashley Sipola. Eight. Whoa. Whoa. 
would be the other way. Up yep. This one? Whoa. Whoa. The side. Whoa, 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 whoa. Really staying right there. Sorry. Well, that's one thing we've seen since uh, last Friday and the wild card game that up weight with the out turn and it doesn't move very mm -hmm. much. Yeah, the uh, common theme for most curlers is the out turn tracks a bit. And, uh, it takes a long time for it to come back if you poke it out a bit. Lisa, there though. Lisa, hard. Hard, Lisa. Almost in, guys, go. This better curl outside really in. Gotta push, Lise. All right, Lise, right it's really hard. tight. That hard, was almost go. middle keep 12, hard. Cheryl. Hard, if they can keep this Lise. alive, it'll curl five feet. Go, I don't oh, know if it oh, might have the legs. No, not quite. No. Hold there. Yeah. Yeah. Uh. Just missing a piece here. Sorry? Just missing a hair here. Yeah, I miss like their edges basically. Okay, let's go uh, nine. Okay. Tough little shot. We watched the overcurl on the hack waiter. That looks like really minimum ice. Big weight though, nine yes. second. Mm -hmm. That'll hold it pretty nine straight. Hard. Boy, really grabbed her early. Hard. Grabbed her very early, Lily and Gates. Don't go for the red yes. double now. Is another whoa, option. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Through it goes. No. And spill, watch that one. Sorry, you guys. And that will go all the way through. So they do get one of the stones off the center. Touch center guys. Yeah. Well, that was a chance there. Wasn't touch, an easy touch, shot, but uh, boy, you forget through that port, you turn the flip the end around completely. Day in Canada, and Brian Mudrick will be with you as well as Bob Weeks. One hour special immediately following our coverage this afternoon or approximately 5 p.m. Eastern Time yep. to highlight Whoa. the game in our country Whoa. as well as Whoa. one very, very Whoa. special announcement. Whoa. Another chance to come through. Whoa. Wow. Yeah. And then just sits right there. <laughs> A lot of people holding breasts on that <laughs> shot. <laughs> it's all about the body language in these shots. <laughs> oh, that was close. Oh. I'm surprised uh, that Krista wasn't on them to try and make it curl just a little yeah. bit. Follow it, sure do. Get a little bit of roll, even better. Yeah, then it just pops out into the open on the other side. Nicely done, though. And did Joe hold this one? Like, look at it going hard there. That's precision. The change in turns made it even harder. Go, uh, 10? Just make sure I'm a 10? Yeah, yeah, 10. This might curl a hair more than during the round robin. Yeah, hard. Ten. Hard. Little down. Hard, really hard. Ten and a half. Hard, hard. to stick. Gates and Chip, hello. Hard, 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 hard. Trying to hold this now. Is there a roll there behind their own? And too thin. Now, the question is whether it will even hang around. And it finally does, but Shotstone belongs to Ontario Curry without last round. Top eight. 
top four this way is okay. Top Again, a week ago, you make that shot. It's just, yeah, he's just changed the hair. Had to be shot rock there. Sit. It's just the little things, hey, Russ, because yeah. now, you know, they don't have to chase and they get to get, take a chance to get around this mm -hmm. center first. You might have rolled buried there and created an error, scored your two. It's pretty good. Like, we were able now to Now you could give up a steal. Wider line. It's a little wider, seen, but. We threw it, though. Okay. Right top four. Not that deep. Okay. Just top Loss eight. is perfect. Okay. Line's important, okay. right? Anything can hang a hair high. Okay. Nice speed out here. Same as my last one in the middle. I think close. Yeah, I think so. Interesting that her three wins, Rachel Holman, none have been in the West. Kingston, Montreal, and St. Catharines. Line's really good. Clean at least. Okay. Last Full eight at least. Sit. Go. Gotta go. Come on, drag it. This will carve Hard off the corner we gotta now. Go. Let's... <laughs> Should hook. Go, 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 go. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Trying to wrap this <laughs> around. Oh. And they will. Very nice. It's it's and it's it. not in the hole. It's totally covered. Good shot. Just nice. great judge. Really good weight call. Both brushers knew the path. Yeah. She has it either way, probably. Okay. I was say we could just come around here, but she would probably have it either way. Yeah. This is probably too tough, eh? Do you have any of that? No. No. So high. But it's high. I think you can do I it. I think it'll curl enough. It is high. Mm -hmm. But just like hack, maybe? Try the run. The only thing is we have to totally to peel it Even off almost if we, we can't come close. What about this? Yeah. Like back line? Yeah. Really good call. Throw the appropriate weight. The yep. right? You'd love to tap it out, but I don't think you can. Um, probably here. Yep. Say it's close. That's what I was thinking. Well, and you can set yourself up this way for a uh, run back with the yellow. Progressively getting better from those early days of six and then to a fourth. All the way through. It's it's the okay, win just tap losses. It back, so so, you know, second straight line. year now. Three straight years, I guess, but as second as in a row. Guard, eight and three. Yeah. But it was 60. It was a little less than that That's last. the year when she won yeah. the uh, yeah. silver medal, losing Girl. to Chelsea Carey. Just needs to take that next step. And uh, what a step it would be if she could win this and be the uh, champion as they Back go back whoa, to whoa, Thunder whoa, Bay. Whoa, whoa. whoa, whoa. Kelly Hi, Law in 2000, really and then Jennifer go. Jones back-to-back back in eight Hi, and nine. Jen. There are your uh, Hi, three teams at one other the three, four game. Yep. Hard, yep, watch yep, yep. Keep going, keep going. Hard, go, 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 go. Get okay. it out of the forefoot. Okay. okay. We have to go this way. Yeah. Yeah. A little short, okay. Just a pound heavy back. there, and it didn't Basically. curl. And that is really, you and I talked about it, I don't know how many games we'd look over, and that's what she's been so yeah, exceptional at this week, is mm -hmm. throwing the exact right weight, yeah. under pressure, yeah. big shots, not overthrowing. Where's ideal? You James know, you commented on her delivery yeah. and how technically yeah. strong she was, yeah. and yeah. even under pressure, big yeah. shots to win a game doesn't change. Well, if you're confident with your delivery and you're sliding at the okay. target, and then you're worrying about one thing, one thing only, and that's the speed. And at that time, she was actually a little heavy. Final stone for Rachel Holman. Great opportunity now for Ontario to force right back here in three. I think you're there. Yeah. Close line. Room. Lights close. Gotta be safe. Eight. Gotta be full eight. Line's great. Full four. I'm looking up. Gotta go. Gotta go, Lisa. Joe, take it. Come in. Joe. Push, guys. Come on. Hard. Hard. Okay. Leave it. She overcurled a bit. Yeah, it shows, isn't it? Shot Rock is showing the back corner. Setting back edge of the four. Just a, Still a just tough shot. Guess. Yeah, looks like it. My concern here, Cheryl, and obviously you overthrow it, you miss it too, but um, 
that curled hard, and, and I think we're onto something with a little bit more dish to hair more curl from the corner. Okay, so saying that, yeah. Cheryl, okay. ever think you play the uh, the intern wide, or do you go to this because yeah. Yeah. you've played it most recently? No, you know what? I like the intern. Mm -hmm. like, that was actually my first thought: is play the intern. Yeah, she just played it, and she's seen a couple down there. And there's not as much like you rub off that top 12 foot redstone that Rachel just threw. You get nothing. Okay. It's real close. Line's good, no back. curls early, they Z won't be able line. to hold it. Back four. No back. Z line. Z close. Then line only. Back go. four. It's all there. Ash, then go. Back eight. Yep, Ash. Go, Ash. Yep. You gotta go. Keep going, yep. go, yep. go, yep. go, go. Take go, it right go, down go, to go. it. Okay. Nice Very nice. One yellow? One yellow it is. Good response by Krista McCarville. As we trade singles and we're tied at 20. World Junior Championships winding up in Russia in the men's final. Canada facing Switzerland. Pick it up in the sixth. Canada leading 2 1. And Jacques Gauthier with the uh, nose hit and sticks it around to score two. Canada to lead it 4 1. And they never trailed in the game. Make the final 7 2. Canada has Jacques Gauthier, Jordan Peters, Braden Payette. Zach Balaka and their alternate Thomas Dunlop are your world men's junior curling champions. And uh, congratulations to a proud mama. <laughs> <laughs> Kathy. That's watching awesome. some early mornings. He set her alarm for, I think it was three in the morning, and another night, one in the morning, and watched the game. Yeah, what a great win. Uh, yeah, what a great like mom. <laughs> yes. And Jacques' sister, Gaetan, was here. It's reading yeah. week for her at university, and so she's been here, and they've been burning the midnight oil, as it were, watching some okay. games. 13-hour difference between Moose Jaw and uh, Russia. Lisa Weagle in a 1-1 one, one tie as we play here in four. They're quiet. Yep. Yep. Really hard up. Hold the line up. Line set. Hard. You got to go. Center guards coming up in a hurry here. Hold it off the line up. Hard up. Roll it, Joe. Roll it all the way over. Hard. And we'll spill it in. Roll that shooter off the center line, but it's covering the edge of the four. Remember now it is Ontario and Holman okay. that does have the last one. Carbon oh. copy of the last end and just uh, reverse order. It yeah, is. Yeah. Jen Gates kicked the uh, Ontario rock in the rings and now uh, Lisa's done it. Okay. Pass. Ashley Sifala in Scotty, a fourth. Okay, we're a little deeper in the Scotty's path. appearance okay. returning Watch to the team deeper. after a year You're away. Jen. So son go, Jake Jen. No, easy, is easy, now easy, 10 easy, months easy, of age. Easy. Okay. A little bit longer than they wanted. <laughs> yeah. What piece? Looks like it's like Three a quarters half. is close. Okay, just to where you guys can hold it. Yeah. Joanne Courtney, fifth Scotties for her. She has the one win. And they'll get that, run it back, and get the one on the side. Courtney, of course, after those years with uh, Val Sweeting, won a silver medal with her in 14 before uh, joining uh, Rachel Holman. Wow, we talked about that first year with Rachel Holman and how hard Joanne had to work to you know, groove a similar release to the rest of this team. I think it was more of a frustrating year for her than it was anything, and a lot of hard work. Hey, stay with it, Jen. Go a bit. Stay with it, Jen, I think. How high are we? Tight. 
Tight. Whoa, whoa, then, whoa, then. Yeah, whoa, we're tight. Then. Oh, it's over curling. A little oh, higher no, than no, tight. No, 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 way over curling right now. It's got to stop. No, gotta no, stop. no. It's, it's real coming down, so okay. sit. Okay. Pretty good. Nice weight. <sighs> You'd like them closer, obviously. And then there's enough room to get back there and get them. Back 12. Yeah, that's okay. okay. You finish hard here on the O-turn. Speed in here. Yeah. I didn't think jo Joanne got out to it on that last out turn, just slid tight, didn't quite get out to the broom to make sure she does on this spot, because as you say, it'll go. Yep, yep, hard. Nine, 10, hard. Hard up. 10, 11. Got to go. Hard for the front. Whoa. 11. Whoa, off. Don't want to double tick this and leave the yellow. Good. And yeah, they avoid the... Uh... <laughs> They're rubbing the way by, opening up that center line again. Smart call there, Vic. They, uh, they didn't keep hoping to get it by. Rachel noticed right away they let it curl. If they don't let it curl, the yellow one stays in the center line. Kendra Lilly. I think it's just half. Pretty high. high. Okay. Roll eyes. Higher than half. Still a hole there. Go, 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 go. And they couldn't get it to the center line. And it's even higher. Yeah, that doesn't work well. There's a hole and there's a couple corners to roll behind. Yes. Emma miscue. That's that roll that they just can't use and get behind. So it sits in the hole. Try to roll back, I think, eh? Yeah. Or does this look easier? Maybe. Probably, eh? Yeah. The hole's smaller so. with the out turn, but I'm not sure you can hang around like with the 10? in turn. Sure. I know why they'd like to get behind that yellow if it's their color, but would you be unhappy, Cheryl, if you can flop it over behind the red? No, Ten. no, I think you just in, in this situation just yeah. want to be behind something yeah. so they don't have a hit and roll back. Yeah. Either or would be fine. Through they come. Whoa. Now, where's this roll? No, there's nothing. Oh That's tough. That was just really good at result really you'd have to take some weight off it and then that port smaller Are they on it? Oh, 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 do you get across the nose? Oh, and they'll pop it the other way, but into the open. <laughs> that was close. You heard Emma go, we're on the guard. And they were until the last second. How close, right. <laughs> that close. <laughs> Those young eyes, eh? They, they, they just yeah. get away. They know where it's going. <laughs> okay. Ten, ten and a half. Okay. Just roll like a rock. Yeah. Yeah. Even show a piece Even of the outside yeah, yeah. is okay. Okay. That's a really good solution if you you want Rachel coming at it with the out turn. If you roll a rock, Rachel rolls left as we're looking at it, and it should be open. Skip stone. Oh, Crystal McCarville. Oh, 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 
one more time now. They've got to get back by their own. And yes, they do. Get across the nose. Now, where will this end up? Sit down. Oh, my can. It's showing itself. I knew the minute we got off. Yeah. They were holding it. That was the problem. The minute we got off. Yeah. <laughs> I think there was a bit of a urgency to get a bye. Then once they got a bye, the elbow, which allowed it to curl. Oh, you gotta get the feeling Rachel's gonna make this one. We let go off the line and we didn't roll enough. Okay. They know the spot and they can roll behind just about anything. How are you throwing it? Keep it there. Okay. Up to speed it? Yeah. Yeah. Got something here? Somebody gonna take advantage? Hard, 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 Sandra. Hard. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Right. They'll hang it around back edge of the 12. That's Sorry. good though. Just really tried to go for it. And because it's behind those stones, it's behind cover. Mm -hmm. So then you have to ignore it. And then these guards are so long. Okay. What are the odds of burying it that uh, Rachel cannot get at it? Thanks. Thank the brushers for getting that extra inch curl just to allow this to stick around in the rings. And Lily in good position, just not able to drag it through. Yeah, taking some weights there. Emma was a nice one. Yeah. 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 I was going here for Jens to get to center. Yeah. So we probably have to go here. Okay. Like that? Yep. This is an interesting approach, huh? It's, yeah, well, I think in this case, Vic, you'd, you'd, you'd want to go around a center one, but the yellow one is so long. Probably have to have a good release. If they go, you know, into this type of area, okay. Rachel can get at it with the amount of curl. So they're trying to go around a tighter one to make it that much shorter of a, a time period to have curl. But they're doing it with, uh, with the intern, correct? Yeah, because the out turn hole is okay. pretty dangerous. You, you could play the out turn, but just take it high enough to be shot. So mm -hmm. just biting eight foot, then they don't have as much time to chase it. You gotta come through that uh, hole as well though. And it's between the two reds coming up. And then you had it sit and down. Anything for line? No, either way. And hello, just. Oh, just winking at you through that hole again. Be nice. It almost came out to the center line hole. Yeah. yeah, I think that's the way to hit it. Turn to go for two. I don't mind because it's half rock. Little thick. Make it spill a little thinner. It's harder than nose, no? I just think the angle you have more room to. Like there's more room. Like you could roll a little, whereas this is you have to hit right on the nose. Yeah. I think I know this one though. Okay. That's like a wild guess. Okay. Or the straight draw in the out turn, which it is an easy high. shot, but not as rewarding. The hole isn't there, right? Rachel's skill set. She's uh, going to be close on this. You see the yellow. Right? How much? You can you see, see the yellow? You have maybe a little piece. Just a little bit. Okay. Like a sliver. I've seen this a bunch. It does Okay. okay. So Let go not, a few quarters on the inside. That was quickly shaken off. We're not going to do that. Play the show. I think so. And it, well, I like that she seems to know exactly where yes, to put the broom. That helps. Emma kind of tried to talk her into running the other one, and she said, "No, I know what this will do and where to put the broom." So. Yeah, the reward is worth it. Five straight wins. Yeah, they've all been close. And we're tied here at one as we play in four. Yes. Yep. Woo, 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 woo. Says he's paid it a bunch, run it back, and runs it by. So Gamble on the run back and lost rather than playing the draw.
2-1, Northern Ontario. I wonder if she's thinking about the draw now. But she can't get it back. Rachel Holman elected to play the run back. Ran it by Steel of One, Northern Ontario. So as we welcome you back on this Saturday afternoon to Moose Jaw and this three four page playoff, Northern Ontario with a two one lead. We go to five and Ontario once again. Rachel Holman will have last rock playing the Redstone. Did you ever do a lot of that Cheryl and second guessing yourself? Uh, yes. You? Yeah, yes, okay. you do. I mean, there's times when, <laughs> of course, when it doesn't work out, you think, I wish I would have, but yeah, you also have to park it. So you go with what your instinct is, I think, at that point. Yeah, she's yeah. looking at, so I give up a steal. Yep. Uh, Russ made a good point, though. The only thing that I would have questioned in that, and you did too, Russ, was the weight she threw yeah, at it. Yeah, that's just it. Yeah, it's a lot. You know, I, I think I would have leaned towards the draw, but Rachel's such a wonderful hitter, and she, she knew that spot, but... It's tough to throw a run back at eight seconds <laughs> and get it to stick. So the, it took bit. your brushers oh, oh. right out of the play. Well, the, and she had the draw really either side. She just watched McCarville come down yeah, with the yeah, interns. She, yeah, the other side may have okay. would bend a little okay. bit more, but uh, the paths were there. She, she wasn't blocked. No, and, and it's not like she's been uncomfortable with draws this week. Oh. She's been 80 some percent for the week and making lots of them. So it wasn't that. Just uh, one of those calls. She seemed to really like the spot in the ice and knew what it would do. And I think it was just a lot of weight. A little solid. Whoa. Close. Yep. Whoa. Hard. Yes. Hard. Hard. Now they're going to fight to get Hard. it by this Whoa. Whoa. corner. Whoa. And okay, they do. Now, okay. can they shot. hold it at the back? No, they can't. There's, there's that example again of panic sweep to get a buy, and there's, oh, wait a minute, it's not finishing. I could have thrown a little less weight. Good shot, though. But that's that's the trick. We we haven't seen a great come around a corner yet. I said Ontario did a good job here with the Lisa throwing the corner. It's a hair longer than they have been, so they get a bit more room to sink this. Be interesting to see if Joanne can actually bury one here. They're carving it. Three. Hard. Hard, guys. Keep going. Keep Line's going. Line's perfect. Tighter the better. That, I think that makes it to the top eight. It is buried. Yeah, it was pretty good. You guys like this? It, it seems to be tougher so to call okay. with, you, you know, a back line halfway. Mm -hmm. So ha mm -hmm. halfway? Mm -hmm. Can't we come up? Yeah. Okay. Maybe even okay. a little higher. Okay. Okay. It's nice here. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, I thought mine were. Really nice. Hey, up, Jen. Jen, hold it out there. Where Pretty high. Going? Where? Pretty really high. high. Not yeah, even easy, then, easy. Well, then. That's okay. That's okay. Whoa. Half, half. Okay. Yep. A little bit. A little bit. Kendra, a bit. Yep. Hard, Kendra, a bit. Yep. Whoa, whoa. Lily with some late licks now to drag it over and just get up to the center line. So the shot rock is covered and there is a slight, slight stagger. Or the turret's throwing a lot of long guards, which can hurt you because it gives you room to get around. But I think against Holman, it's a good idea because those run backs that they're so famous for are that much tougher. And by it goes. A little tighter, tuck a hair. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, now they can actually one down a split here, center line on this, tuck it around that uh, longer so yellow guard and make the run back really tough. One draw 25 easy, kind of skews your numbers, but it was just a couple feet light on a guard. Take a look. Whoa, easy. Not quite tight. 
Okay. Go Tyson. Jen, I think a little. Yep, go hard. Yes. Hard. Easy, easy, Jen. Easy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. If anything, it's ashes. Sit, sit, sit right there. Nice perfect. shot. Hey, Kendra. That's where you wanted it, Cheryl. <laughs> it's perfect. Tight. I didn't think that was that tight. I had fifth. No, me neither. It's pretty I know she had. I think if you get the first two, it goes right back onto Shot Rock. You might get them all. Emma Miskews going to yeah, give it a go hard. here. Yeah, hard. Courtney right away. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Still, Courtney. One, two, touch it. Oh. No. Shot. It opens everything up. Smaller each. It just keeps backing up. Like, they're floating late in the sheet. Yeah. Well, then we haven't heard a lot of that. Okay, more mall. I know. Or, uh, stones floating a little bit. Yeah, we and we haven't. What we've heard is, you know, it's running really straight down this spot, but they're to see things falling actually is what they're referring to. That's new. Okay. I think it's and I don't think it's a release at all for anybody because you can see they're coming out up and it's just tracking back. Hold it out there, Ash. You gotta hold it out there. It's tight. Gotta hold it out there. Real tight. Curl this time. Oh, the same spot. Whoa, no, 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 it's got to sit. Got to sit. Okay. Okay. Well, it's the right a lot tighter and yeah, a little overcurled. Wow, well, the good thing, only good thing probably about that is they left like the that? right side showing. Yes. You show them the other side and they've got the hit and roll behind the corner. This, at least, they can't do that. As to your point about uh, you know the 15, if you curl 85 percent, the 15 percent that you're going to miss, you want to manage that properly. Ryan, That's what Kendra did there. Hard. Oh. Emma missed you. Yep. 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 Highball at least. Hard. Go. 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 Hard to roll. Hard. Hard. Gotta go. All the way over. Hard. The yellow reach. Hard. It's gone. Perfect speed. Very nice. Yep. I think again, we mentioned too, uh, yeah. we, these rocks as being as lively as they are, the, the ice as good as it is, you don't have to throw it overhand. Not at all, no question. You do so much when yeah. you have the right amount of weight. That's right. Thanks. And uh, two reasons yeah, for that your front end, happening. get them involved. Yeah, the, the lighter you yeah. throw it, the more so they can uh, maneuver the stone. Yeah, yeah. Yep. Yep. right. Trying to roll here. Um, that rock comes up nice. Yeah. Ten. Whoa, whoa. Little whoa. up. Whoa. No, no. Whoa. Skip yeah, stone. Jen, Jen. Hard, Jen. Gotta go. Whoa, whoa. Whoa, the other way. Roll. Where are you gonna go? Okay. And right. they roll it away from that center. Right, it's a little solid. Yeah. Okay. Team, okay. Uh, Holman can, it looks like they're setting up for the draw here. Mm -hmm. They could, I was going to say they could hit roll behind either options, either guards, but they draw them behind. It's easier, isn't it? I would say so, typically when it's a single guard, but you've got a lot to roll mm -hmm. behind, too. If this is made properly, you've lost your blank, but uh, there's a good chance Rachel Holman will be buried here or close to it. But behind. The yes. color the is the more. question. Yes, right? the tight yellow one there. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, she could actually go behind the corners, but then uh, that might force uh, McCarvel around that yellow center guard. And the hit numbers you saw there for her at 63, that's obviously affected by that last run back she missed. Okay, we're close. Wait, close. Coming in nice. No, we're there. Seven. You can't be deep on this. You have. Uh, Chris to follow you down, yeah, and there it goes. You're getting forced then. It's top button. It's pretty good. That's it. It's curling. Yep, 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 yep. There it is, right in behind. Very nice oh. to the top of the button. And it is covered. Just perfect. Yeah. Nice lead. Good throw. Nice. It's just a different style a game a skip can a call when around. you know you're feeling draw weight like that. How much of that do you have? Quarter. And that's so that's you know again leads back to that last shot that she played the run back. The guard's really tight. 
You know she's got that draw ability. She's worked very hard on it. Yeah, I know that the hit is still her game, but she has draw weight. A lot of options in this case, because if you freeze, I'm not sure there's enough room. Well, there isn't enough room this way, and this would be really hard to get in for two. I know the tendency is you want to get that thing out of there. You can play the run back, you can play the tap. They're all hard. But a well placed freeze, a little bit on the high side here. I'm not sure Rachel can score two. And what's your goal if you're Northern Ontario coming in? Force. Force. So yeah. that would hold uh, Ontario to a single. Well, and you mentioned it, Russ, on Rachel's first one, that the hit would have still given the chance for a blind, which you, you would probably take in a, the fifth then. In front of the stone. Trying to keep it a little high side. And uh, still a little, little, little bit high side, but right to the, almost right to the nose. Just a really good shot. Now it's tough. The front end's job was to get it on the X, as we always say, make sure it's the right speed. But what uh, really nice speed there. Yeah. It's like pretty yeah. quick. Kendra and Christopher are trying to do is keep that rock a little bit higher than that. Chen Gate saying it's really quick. If it had been there, the shot's probably not makeable. Brilliant shot, though. Any path I've thrown then seems oh, then to be pretty nice good. Game, yeah. Yeah. Sitting the one. Final stone. Looking at a piece of the lid for two. Little light, yes, the line. Go. Why don't we? Go. Oh, we seven. And two of the best. Judging the stone Where? on the front end. Really close. We're, yeah, we're clean. Yep. Hard, hard, hard. How, whoa, whoa, whoa. Back four. Back four. Need a little lid here. Oh, rubbing and rolling. And spilling away. Oh, goodness. Have a look. That little spill back. I think it's just one. Great try. Yeah. It is just the one. One red. So Northern Ontario does exactly what they want to do, and that is force and so midway through this three, four page playoff. We are tied at two. Just a reminder, coming up right after our coverage, a one hour special curling day in Canada. There's the merchandise available here at this year's Scotty. The Scotties Tournament of Hearts is brought to you by New Holland, proud sponsor of Curling Canada. Welcome back to Moose Jaw Championship Weekend has arrived at the Scotties as fans file in to get a few snacks and maybe a beverage celebrating this game and of course celebrating Curling Day in Canada. Welcome back inside the building. Brian Mudrick joined by Bob Weeks and once again Bob for the second straight year we celebrate this great game right across the country. I know Lindsay Hamilton after a contest online is with the Briar Tankard in one community across Canada. Also John Epping one of the nicest men in sport. You got a great feature coming up on him. It's a very powerful interview, Brian. It discusses him being an openly gay person and also an elite curler. The reaction of the curling community to his coming out a few years ago, as I said, very powerful interview. I think that people will not want to miss. During the Grey Cup, our Cheryl Bernard got a chance to work with the CFL on TSN panel. And I guess it's called human curling. You need humans to curl, but this sounds pretty fascinating, this feature. This is a different kind of human curling, and I can tell you our CFL panel took to it. They were very excited about it. Nobody more excited than Rod Smith. Wait till you see Rod Smith going down in a takeout in a, I, well, you have to watch it. It's just too amazing to describe. So obviously we have the 3-4 game right now, but tonight it is the one-two page playoff game. That is a battle of Manitoba as Anderson goes up against Jennifer Jones. You know what's cool? That Curling Day in Canada right now is trending. Not Bob and I, but the actual event is trending. And look at this, we got hoodies. 
As my model Bob, oh God, you can do better than that. There you go. Curling day in Canada as well. If you go to the website, you can get your very own hoodie. So please join us right after the three, four page playoff game. It is curling day in Canada. We are in Moose Jaw. As a lot of fans are getting some souvenirs, we'll see you right after this game at roughly 5 p.m. Eastern time on TSN. Well, we already saw the men win gold at the World Junior Championships in Russia. Let's check in on the women. Pick it up in the fifth, score 4-1, and Mackenzie Zacharias with last rock facing one hits and stays around for a couple. That cuts the Korean lead to one, and then on to the ninth with the score tied at five. And Korea facing three, trying to draw to uh, score one. That would have been tough. And she'll slide on through. Canada steals two. They lead at 7-5. And that would be your final score as Mackenzie Zacharias, Carly Burgess, Emily Zacharias, Lauren Lenentine, and their alternate Rachel Erickson are your world women's curling junior champions. So congratulations to both Canadian junior teams after a slow start. Dropping their openers, they have gone on and come back to win gold in Russia. As we welcome you back on this curling day in Canada. In a 2-2 tie, we go to six. And Northern Ontario and the team from Thunder Bay, the Fort William Curling Club, skipped by Krista McCarville, will have last rock. They have the hammer playing the yellow stone. was their first inclination, but it's it's tough to tap it all the way into a good spot without knocking it right out. Just well, back eight, I think. Yep, yep. maybe back 12. Yep. Hard. Hard. Going to the tick on the top. Hard. Yes. Hard. You gotta go. It's going to be touch and go. Run. It's going to hit a lot hard of the red. Oh. As a skip, you really don't like those. <laughs> All the sweeping part. You yeah. <laughs> yes. So in a 2-2 two -two tie, both teams pretty close. The, the thing that jumps out, however, Rachel Holman. All week, number one in hits at 89%. However, right now, through the first five, on her hits, 63%. You also have to look at the half. You know, there's a couple check marks you want to weigh the team by. How well are they forcing? Well, McCarville's done that twice. That's big against Homan. Um, have you allowed any steals? Homan's allowed a stolen in in the fourth. And really, it's been Krista pushing Rachel's numbers down. She made that great uh, intern draw in the fourth end and got a steal out of it and made that freeze in the fifth end to push Rachel to a really tough single. Yes. Good change okay. here. Well, they just yeah. kind of automatically went up to hit the same guard, really and then they went. I like that. We can Sorry, get this dangerous one, one. Yeah. a foot off the I rings, and maybe roll that. behind one of those I yellows. Okay. You got it, Ash. Just nice don't throw. overthrow this. Just a hack waiter. Weed's pretty good. Yep. Whoa. Yep. Whoa. Three. Yep. Whoa. Yep. Yep. Whoa. 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 Hard, 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 Counting hard, is hard, over, hard, catch hard. enough of it, and then. Out, Krista. Right and out. will it have enough to go? Shooter goes, raised rock doesn't. Oh, you know, it, even if you knows that. Shoot. You didn't have to try quite that hard for the roll. Right that's that's, right here, that's to too bad because it was so close okay. to being good. And now Rachel's got what she's won. She's got a saver in there already. She's got a guard. You want to at least force them to make yeah. a shot. Yeah, even if you just hit and stay there. Yeah, yeah. Rachel's got to deal with it. Oh, 
Now the only uh, in, close. Like a good part of this for probably McCarvel's team is that that guard is really long, so mm -hmm. they're going to try and get as much separation as they can. They never, never just throw a tight one, but this one looks like it's going hard. Might have grabbed. You don't want it in, really, because it's going to be wide open. I know, but we're not going to really get... Close the same thing. Shoot a little I more weight. More on mine. Same weight? We can shoot a little more. Let's yeah. go bump. Okay. That was like it wasn't very half. far off bump, though. It's tough to throw more weight and yeah, stay I thought in that, I thought that was curious when yes. you said that. Yeah. It's there, but... Again, control Bump. the cue ball. Don't like roll bumps. out here. Oh. Jen, Jen, hard. Again, it's up to Gates here trying hard. to help this Jen, over. Really hard. Really hard. Oh, dear. And, and both will go. Yeah, she seemed to be more concerned about getting rid of the shooter mm -hmm. than what was going to happen with her throne rock. Yes. Got my miscue. Three. Don't want to be a Mine's good. You can clean a little. I don't think we're in. Really tight on the light side, I think. We close. Take a look. We're close. Not in. Really tight. No, 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 no. After the rotation. No, no. We don't want to overthrow it. Tight. Very sweet. Really good. Trying to throw a better guard that they can use. Go around. So. When do you ignore? Okay. It's not in. I would, I would like the and you've got that, of course, the Ontario is hitting the one at 9 o'clock on the tee line. Well, I think you I ignore like now? Well, I think the double peel is almost impossible. And they have buried that one they just threw, so I think you have to. Yes. They talked about intern draw. It's almost not there. You have to be like tee line uh, any lighter than that, it would over curl. Yeah. This is the right call, I think. And you could go around your corner, but you know what Rachel's going to do? Yeah. <laughs> She's going to go right around the center, so might as well beat them in. I'm going to try Hockey. that with Kendra yeah, Lilly. Real for now, but you got to be here. It's your curl. Ashes. Ash, you got to go. It's Ashes. Got to go really hard. We're sitting wide. Got to go. Wait there. Got to go. Go, 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 Ash, go, Ash, go, Ash. Go, Ash. Both of you go. 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 Trying to get go. some curl, hard. it should finish. Hard. You gotta go. Oh, keep going, keep going. Keep going. Go, 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 go. Great weight. Just, just didn't bust didn't in there for them. No. Sitting the shot rock, T line, four foot. And the problem is, is by trying to get that to curl, they took it deep. Nice shot. Now if Holman's team can freeze on it. Yeah. You're out of room. Yeah, it becomes a very tough deuce. And as you look at that left side, which is the intern side, is there a path still there, or are those guards in the way? Yeah, they're in the way. I think Vic, it's just the port's too tight with the amount of curl on that intern side. All this all started by just two hit and roll outs trying to be cute and roll buried. Seven. Let it go, Elise. Seven, eight. Eight. Can we let it come down? No. Stop now. Just Lisa. Can't bounce at all. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Stay close, Lise. Hard, no. Lise, go. Both of you, both of you, go. Bounce hard. Go, 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 go. Hard. Pretty good. Yeah, didn't get across the nose. Shotstone still belongs to Northern Ontario. Close. Okay. Yeah. 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 Similar draw weight. Exact Fair same more. shot. Similar. Cheryl, and maybe just move that a foot. Get to the inside somehow. Move to the. Yeah, so that you can have a chance maybe to you know, remove your yellow so it's not, or not out of the rings, but so that it's not uh, impeding you getting rid of that red. Yeah, you can move Whoa, both yellows no. towards center line here if you just, really? just it's really close. soft. Oh, no. I have to go for long, wait. Top four. And this oh, stone yeah. didn't curl. It, oh, yeah, I thought it would go hard at the I end. Did, I did too. Hard ash. Hard ash. Top four. Team hard hard ash, ash, Ashley Sippler. Can you get go, across go, the go, nose a little here. bit and it's inside? Okay. Yep, yep, yep. Get yep, across the nose. Ashes. Oh, goodness, and she's inside. That one hooked. Completely different than Emma's. 
Just a great throw. Keep it straight a bit. We talk a lot about the Holman team. They kind of keep it straight with the release, don't they? And that might be the difference. It's there. Okay. Different uh, yep, yep, thrower yep, yep, can yep, get more curl. Okay. Okay. Do that yet. It's pretty good. Yeah, so I was thinking this on the first one, but well, I have no idea what that's. Well, we've seen this. We've thrown board. Like, if you just throw back eight. Has to be absolutely perfect. Yeah. But I mean, if you chisel, we could throw it really hard right here. Okay, I think so. I think we can, do you think we can get shot? Under? I think it's just I sitting right here. Max, right right you're ever yeah, getting yeah. this one. No? They're even, yeah. I don't think you can hit it that thin. You have to basically miss it. And then they're not going out anyways. Emma okay. is very good. How uh, she's, I think, one of the best uh, at seeing lines and angles and behind the T-line, like you just need back eight. I, I just see myself doing this and then it's even worse. She's got to make perfect roll or we're going to have a double. Is it time? Sure. Can, Can you I play know? just rust tap tap, like red, yellow tap? Sit on top, I know. Is it second shot? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Sure. I, th I think yeah. the double's there with the... Ability of At least it's hard to up weight ability to Rachel has. So timeout's been called. Like, Each team given two 90 it's second like timeouts. Marcel Rock is on the ice. Like you're going to be just wide open. What are you, what are you thinking, Rachel? Hmm? I just I think we got to get rid of one. We got two is okay, three is yeah. not. Yeah, so if you if you play it, it might kick that over, and then if they come to it, you might have something off that other one. Maybe. I mean, that way the 11, your angle, or even a. Like, if I'm. I, even if that guard's not there, this is a hard shot. Yep. Yeah. And, and yeah. If, I'm, if I'm like this, it's the same thing. She's yeah. playing a triple, triple yep. guard. Yeah. Double, triple guarded. So, yeah, you might be able to kick that over okay. as well. I think that's our best so. shot. I think that's a ball. Eight. Gotta hit it. Yep. Well, it'll for sure get rid of one. Yeah, this, this, this one's gone for sure. If you get the red a thin half, it obviously hits here. It's going to be very close to kicking that rock like that, how throwing? far it might go, who knows. But if it ever comes out into the open, then Rachel can get at it with her That's next one, and the worst they'll yeah, ever give up is a two. It. You know, it's a sudden death game. You've got to protect that scoreboard. Do you think that's minimum? I think I, I, I'm with uh, Rachel and Coach on this one. You played that intern freeze. It was pretty tough, Cheryl. I didn't like that. I, I would look to play that. Um, Red, yellow, tap. Get rid of one yellow. Mm -hmm. it, yeah, they, but same shot, same as this with softer weight. Yeah, yeah. they said it. Uh, the just worst thing. They don't want to give Hard. up three. Here we go. Hard Joe! Skip stones right away. Hard. Joe and Courtney. Hard Joe. And we'll see what happens. They get rid of the one. Then they have their catcher on the side, but they did not move the shot rock. I wanted to high side it a lot more. Oh, that was flying, wasn't it? Cool. And then again, I we mentioned so often, I know you want to throw weight at it. You didn't have to throw that much and really have nothing. I know Joanne Courtney's there, but the, the amount of effect she had in that stone was probably mm -hmm. very little. Yeah, zero. Oh, yeah. Zero. With that kind of weight, nothing. Kudos for keeping up to it. Says the skip. Okay. Rachel's still it's got a, nice a chance because if, if this isn't proper, there might be a double, uh, yellow double. You've, it's really hard to sit two. I think I could have gone to Jenna. Could you throw sure. like a hack weight here, Cheryl, and just roll left? So and then Rachel has we'll to hit it and you've got no, your deuce. We'll, we'll so I like that because it like takes away the two. risk of no. leaving a double. You, right, that's we'll the worry, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. So if you roll towards your shot stone, now maybe corner frozen, she sees enough of it and makes the double. Is Possible, it? yes. Okay. And it's hard to sit two this way. They're basically playing a freeze. And, well, they have to bump it, really, to, to sit two. There might be a double. Okay. To it. Can't tap it. Really, we're very really close to it. Close. Can't tap it. T-Line. Yeah, it's going to tap yep. it a bit. It's going to tap Tapping. it. Tapping. No. It's tap back four. four. Whoa, then. It's back four. Close. Don't wreck on the yellow. Yeah. Whoa! Oh. No! It's back four. Oh, how good was that? That might go straight. It touches the yellow. 
It rolls open. There's an easy double. They still might fly, though. Maybe too good. Yeah, that. I think they may have needed to be on it or else let it curl a little more, but then they might not be sitting too. Now, there is that red stone right there at the four. Does that present a problem getting rid of the, uh, yes. the higher yellow? Yes. So you hit this really thin. The right hand one goes out like crazy. Right. The yellow one's spinning like you won't believe. It'll hit the red. Will it skid to the left far enough? Again, it's a track meet for Courtney and Weagle. What do they got? Bang! Oh, there it is. There's that catcher. And it'll sit there on that edge of the eight. So a chance for two for Northern Ontario. Yeah, you knew it was going to spin, go straight across the center line, but that rock was already there. And it's funny, watch this. This shooter takes out the dangerous rock, but stays there. And that slows down the yellow one. Less, maybe Smith less, yeah. Really close. Yeah. Little really less. close. Yeah, that yeah. Been Boy, Krista just put that in the perfect spot. Yeah, yeah. close to. Really she has yeah. done that uh, a lot this speed. week. Here, Kudos point. to the okay. brushing too, isn't it? They, they're, they're not. Uh, it's one thing to throw it perfect; you can ruin it on the way down. <laughs> well, and even the line calling, because I think I would have been panicking early on that one. Yeah. You know, their judgment was uh, was terrific. Final stone, looking for a cup. Okay, well, then, in a two-two tie as we play here Wait, in close. six. Have a look, have a look. I'm just heavy clean. right now. Whoa, off that. It's definitely heavier. No, no. Sipola on the left, Gates on the right. Lily okay. calling line. Okay, I'm just going to leave it. And they just back right away. Good. And watch this grind to a halt, top four, and two it is. Northern Ontario with the first multiple really point in. Path. And it comes here in six. Four two Northern Ontario leads Ontario looking for their first ever Scotties win. McCarville against Rachel Holman who has uh, won their first five meetings. And here in the uh, seventh it will be Ontario and Holman. Out of the Ottawa Curling Club that does have last rock playing the Red Stones. So in goes Gates with her first. Up goes that corner and now Gates with the cover. Well, Krista McCarville made a couple of uh, lovely shots and uh, it leads to a couple. Something could really go wrong on this one in about five different ways. You're a little heavy, you roll open, set up a double. You over curl, you tick your own. You just, I, what I was worried was, I thought it was gonna feather the yellow, spin open, absolutely perfect. And then the double attempt didn't work for Ontario and Rachel Holman led to a score of two. The key shot brought to you by OK Time, service, repair, and tight. Rubbed on the corner guard there, Lisa Weagle, but stayed out of the paint, so North Ontario can't hit it. Both those reds still usable for Holman. That was really uh, that do stress uh, based on timing. You know, you saw Krista homing through the tight three guards, so they had double guards. And then Krista looked at a couple different options. Could she chip off that tight one again? And it yes. was just the point of getting there first, putting a little bit of pressure on in a big game. Yeah, they Pays off. Applied the pressure, that's right. Trying to get all three here. Just a shade high side. We might get every one of them here. Good job. Nice shot. And he gets a couple and then spills it out into the open. Boy, look at those reds to be used if Ontario needs them. Yeah, it's tempting to do something about that. You could hit the close one. Whoa. Lisa, roll it. Good job. I know what you're trying to force, but those are really dangerous rocks. 
think we're there. Okay. Line's pretty good. Don't Felt want to. Left. Line's great. Top eight. Don't want to. Top four. Okay. Curling. Stay close. Top Line's eight. pretty good still. Line's good. Line's Just good. Top eight. Right but here. Room, it's going to be Jen. No, no, it's not going to be Jen, I don't no. think. I think so. Yep, a little further. Yep, yep, yep. Hard, hard, hard. Yep, yep, oh. yep. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Nice placement yeah. there, too. So just a little glancing blow on that uh, center line guard. And but the non-offending like, team gets to put it back. They're like control. Sorry? They're like just high side control and try to roll the guard in. Oh, I like that. OK. Little yellow. I like this. Yeah. Control? Yep. Thanks. Going straight through in this line. Yeah, I mean, same piece. We can hold it. Side, so. OK. So that's what they're planning is all those reds that are left around are all there for a reason. And try to tap this back and roll something yep. in behind those reds. Hard, hard, up. hard, up. hard, hard Courtney. Up. Hold it. Joanne Courtney. Hard. Hard. Gotta go, Gotta go. Gotta go. Curling up for and she'll touch the 12 foot stone and out it goes. Well, let's revisit the keys to the game and uh, Northern Ontario, a uh, uh, yeah. force to be reckoned with. Well, they're actually doing that very, very well. It's what they had to do against this high scoring team, scoring nine points a game on average. And they forced them every time they've had hammer. And that's been, I think, so far the key. And then what they've done really well is scored a multiple when they did. And that pressure, remember you said, what did, would they have learned from the uh, watching Manitoba? Well, they put some pressure on Ontario, and that led to the deuce. Correct? Yeah, going early. We just talked about it even in that last end. It's kind of that timing thing. When you're going to go get there first and force Ontario to some tough ones. And a little deep this time, right up to it. And the keys for Ontario going in, Russ. Well, I, I think what uh, we all have talked about all week is Krista McCarville herself and how good she is, and we just saw it last end. So it was all about Ontario being all in because all four of those team members were, were slightly ahead in the stats. So go after McCarville early in an end, make her shots really hard. But you know, Krista's had four or five difficult shots. She made them all. She has been, you can just see it this week. She really wants that uh, Maple Leaf in Thunder Bay. Wouldn't that be something? Uh, you know, and that can sometimes get in the way if that's what, and she's mentioned it a few times during the week that how much she would love to wear that. But when you walk out into the ice, you have to forget that completely. You can't be thinking about yeah, the outcome. The rings and she just goes around. I like, but then the back one's open. Okay. Like that same kind of thing or? She might yeah, be able to run and get rid of both her yellows higher. though. Kendra's come around, came too deep. And yeah. it allowed uh, as long as you can't run it, yeah. Emma to hit and roll to a real right good now. spot. Yeah, I know. That's why if we go a little deeper here, just can't over curl. That's all. Do we have like to that like right here? Roll away a bit, or no way? Like almost edges? No, yeah, or probably hair. a piece. But tough. then the back one's open. I know. Then she can see. Yeah, and then we can't get well, at we it. We can't guard both. So, like there, then she just has it run though. Like, do just we just tight? hit and roll? Like get the red out? I think it kind of like yeah. it. Yeah. Then you freeze on your next. Yeah. Try to, yeah, well, if you're we're rolling. Probably, we're either out. picking or we're taking this one. Yeah, that's fine. That's okay. Pick is nice. Just think I don't. You can throw a, like a board weight okay. sit too, okay. but uh, Rachel's going to use those Nine. reds on the right that yeah. have been, been ignored. Well, and, and there it is. Like because of those yeah. reds, it's, that's what's causing the issues for McCarville. They have, they're trying to look to how to protect because as it sits right now, they run one red into that pile and you're sitting two. Solid. Real close. Yep. Whoa. Hard. Whoa. Yes. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, Jen. Go, Jen. Go, go, go. On the brush, Jen Gates. And Sit they'll and get two and then roll it away yeah. from that center line. I feel like we have to do that, though. So back this end up. Uh, on Northern Trail sitting one. They could have hit. That I, I would say the most dangerous one, the closest red. Mm -hmm. They decided to draw, which was not wrong. They applied pressure, but one missed guard came in deep, and now all those reds are helping Team Holman here. They've got three, two tries 
to Barry and put McCarvel under the gun here. Extra right now. Line's really good. This Joel. Catch. Seven. Line's great. Six, seven. Just Joe. Seven. So we've got to wait here. We're here. Boy, nothing. We're seven. Hard Joe, hard. It'll die here. Oh. And it starts to go now. Yep. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You're there. You're buried. And around it goes. Goodness. Does that ever wait? You have to be so patient. Krista needs one of her freezes now. Follow it down. It slowed down a foot or two, which is a standard. It's happened all week. I think they're they're saying it as like a, it might be. It's not like it's just worst case. case. Yeah. And just split center line, freeze on the corner. Mm -hmm. Makes the draw tougher for Rachel. Real close, top eight, top four. Whoa, That's have a look, guys, have a look. Have a look, No close. bump on this line. No bumping. Just try to curl a little. Line's good. Kate Shirley on the brush, now joined by Sipla Lily calling Get line. Oh. Shot stone, just top really four. Hard. It's covered hard. if they can get it to the corner. It's not there. It's not there. They knew it. Boy, mm. they, their judgment was pretty good. It's not getting quicker in that spot. Should have been there. Yeah. No, they Rachel's died, or uh, Emma's died too. Wow. All of a sudden. This is where yeah. Team Northern Ontario should be talking this over. What, what happened there? That's heavy, right? Yeah. So I think we need I the did extra. hear yeah. Emma before uh, Krista went down the throw talking to Rachel about that path. Mm -hmm. So just that, you know, maybe a little bit more awareness on brushing, catching it, but it's come down a little bit. So, uh, a little bit less rotation from uh, Northern Ontario. Yeah, and they'll, they'll grind a little more mm -hmm. than uh, Emma's will. Emma's got tons of rotation. Faster yeah. here. Yeah. Yeah. Right top four. Uh, yeah. Still uh, throw a three on the scoreboard here now. Yeah, they had the last rock to start. Blank got a single in two, and they gave up the steal with last rock in four, and only got a single in five. So, looking for their still looking for their first multiple points. Back more right now. Eight. Okay, gotta go right back then. Yeah, back we're, we're there, over there. Oh, yeah. oh, 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 oh. You're all there. Back they are. How far okay. back? A little too Fine. far back as they uh, slide too far. Second okay, shot. Now is yeah, that right. stone on Wednesday? the? Uh, Sorry. Nine o'clock or three o'clock rather. Yeah, I thought you were just there. T right line. Now. There it is. It's actually two thirty, but uh, there it is in the eight foot. I thought that was a shade wider yeah, than uh, nice. Emma's. Emma's got into the slide path quicker. So, so did uh, Krista McCarvel's. But that's what she's reading, isn't it, uh, Cheryl? That's what. There's where she's getting her cues from, isn't it? Yeah, it is. And that's what you have to be careful with. Try to look at rotation. Look at the paths. This will be a quicker path. They have to be good because short is really good here. It's really good. Yeah. Lots of stones down this one path. What concerns me on this is they're calling actually T line back four, which could leave a really easy red red run. Right. Like I, I would just guard something to be shot top four. Yep. Line's getting better. I wouldn't be coming in for shot. There are those reds now still that can be run back. Mm -hmm. On Absolutely. that left side, as we look at it, and now where's this going? Uh, this is going deep okay. too. Okay. So now you go. There's okay. that path still there. Yeah, you just look okay. anything, even top eight. But you know, the perfect spot would have been biting top four on the right-hand side of center. When the brooms here, really they curl into the slower stuff. When the brooms here, they glide, and that's what's happened there. The first two are in tighter than the last two. All it takes, yeah, just out the good stuff. Like, but, yeah, kind of Russ, to, to your things, point, yeah. and I understand it, but okay. you need to get it to curl, and where you want it decides where you put the brush down, no? Yeah, you know, no, oh, for sure, no question about it. But I think you could have hidden that uh, easily, but it, the problem with that last one is you throw it short, 
What's Rachel doing? She's okay. got to play a raise Ready. tap to the Ready. forefoot. Yeah. Just tried too hard to get shot. Right. It wasn't necessary. Right. Now you're helping Rachel. If Rachel's heavy here, she's got backing. And uh, now she can follow it down, and she will have some backing. That last stone from a carvel all the way down. And they're just backing right off of this. And there it is to the back four. So no sooner do we say Ontario in their first four attempts, now they do have their first multiple point end. The Scotty's Tournament of Hearts is brought to you by Home Hardware. Here's how. By Cashmere Bathroom Tissue. Nothing feels like cashmere. And by Tim Hortons, the official coffee of Curling Canada. So after a quiet start and being tied at two through the first half, trading deuces now. And we're tied at four, Northern Ontario We'll have the last rock. They'll have the hammer playing the uh, yellow stones here in eight. Well, Northern Ontario tried the tick on their first. A uh, little bit too much weight. Both brushers for Ontario on it got it to the board, so it's back again. So second guard going up. Just to the boards. Oh. Rachel and Joanne brushing it, which is legal. You can have two players from the non-offending team sweep their own rock. Hi, Joe. And take it. Yep, yep, gotta yep. be tight. Carry this. Hey guys, make it good. Go, 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 go. Two things with this guard. Right, you want separation from the top one yeah. and in line. Perfect. Okay. Oh, and yeah. wasting no time around, she says. Let's go, says Krista McCarvel. Top eight. Felt like it was all there, guys. Line's good, yep. Top four. Yes, Whoa. hard. Hard, you gotta go. She's warping sideways. off the corners here now. Hard. Which great. Hard, Kate. You're by. Yep, You're yep, by. Ash, Ash, Ash. Oh, great brush. Good judgment. Yes, oh, goodness. Yes. And yes. around they go. Yeah. And actually a little over curl. You could have kept sweeping to get it more open because the, it's really a guard for Team Ontario. They're going to loop around everything, and there's massive curl on this intern. It's as much curl as we've seen all week. The other option Northern Ontario had instead of trying to play the tick was if, you, if your plan is to blank, which you'd love to, is to go open side and mm -hmm. see. I mean, they won't follow you, but you might have an mm -hmm. easier time of opening it up. Pardon. Pardon. Join Courtney. And again, homing out there, as Russ says, maybe with that little pressure brush. A little bit more scrub in hers here as we play in eight. Just trade that one well, out. They just couldn't get it around. Like here. Okay, fully open. Would you go underneath? I think I'd roll away. Yeah. That's what they're doing. The nose oh, would worry me no. for the freeze. Mm -hmm. no. Or the, you stagger them, they go right around to the yeah. button. Really gotta go for peace. Yeah, this is coming pretty hard. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, it's rolling out. Is that just really up? Not the best result. Nine, well, Northern Ontario coach Rick Lang has uh, had some of his divided attention. Wife Lorraine was here as well. Why? Because uh, Sarah and husband. Uh, Sarah Potts and her husband, Jer Jordan, wanted to uh, thank the entire medical staff at the Thunder Bay Regional Neonatal Intensive Care Unit. Cohen Potts weighed in at 1.7K and Leo at 1.9, and both are still in hospital, but doing well, which uh, just allows me just one moment to say thank you again to all of you who made the donations to the Sandra Schmerler Foundation during our telethon last weekend, uh, last Sunday, because all that money, some 450,000 raised and now over $5 million since 2001, is all in support of neonatal care at hospitals like that in Thunder Bay right across the country. We like I can't the hear you. We like appeal. Okay. <laughs> 
I thought she'd be able to hear us. There's no one in here. <laughs> well, there's a few. <laughs> You gotta get it if you're gonna say it. And you're gonna get that one. There you go. What plan was that? Plan. Well done, the alphabet. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. <laughs> e. Those are two small babies, uh, Vic. I yeah. kind of chuckle that we played against Ricky all those years. And we used to kid that he was 140 pounds at the top of his backswing. He was pretty. He's pretty. He was pretty small, fit oh, curler. Wife Lorraine, oh. Canadian champion, twice oh. over, of course, with Heather Houston, and she headed back to a Thunder Bay last weekend. Oh, there, here we go now, and back they go, and that'll get some a rise from the crowd here as they go back four. Great throw. I think an average brusher puts a couple points on the board during a game, but I'm sure Joanne gets an extra one. It just, I thought she was all over that top yellow. Great brushing. Kendra Lilly. Okay. okay, that's good. Remember that original come around by Northern Ontario okay. is now a guard it's in the rings, but it's really hurting yeah. them to some degree. I don't think he can get to the, well, you might okay, get to the nose. Yeah. Rachel's not going to let them. carry if they can bury anything and I don't think they do. Yeah. Well, not where they okay, wanted that again. one. Yeah. Okay, Jen, get ready. I'm going to throw it to be able to bring it out. Gotta watch okay. where that um, yellow one that they're going to hit redirects to. You might save it over there in the left. Mm -hmm. Just would put a little bit more pressure on Team Holman. And it's not going to hang around. Okay, so just two, yeah. the one where I rolled a little too far. Yeah. Both teams fairly happy at this point. It's, uh, I think, would you say, it's a shot a that Christopher Carvel yeah, can thinner. probably not give up a steal now. But it's sure looking like a force Sorry. advantage, oh, Ontario. Four. Okay. How's this going to run? It'll curl. Yeah, are you throwing it? A little inside uh, the game, you hear them say at times, how are you throwing it? Because she has two releases. And if you're going straight through, that's no pop. Yes, that is exactly that. So depending on the ice surface, surface on ice that's swingy, they've got a little back pop release on it, and the rock will just track down that spot. So that's why they always ask, how are you throwing it? Just so they know what to expect with her release. Yeah. Well, we know that uh, for the first time ever, men's and women's purses are exactly the same. $300,000 in total. First place, 105, and then of course add to that the additional Sport Canada funding for the next couple of years of nearly 170,000. 
and then a spot in the World Championships coming up. And more importantly, I think, to some of them, would be that ticket to the trials that will be played in Saskatoon in December of uh, 21 to determine who will play in uh, Beijing at the Olympics. Just an impressive move by Curling Canada, the parody in the money. And that was just announced. Uh, Canada Cup that they were going to have the equal winnings for men and women. No, it's really nice. Yep. Go Ash. No, no. Okay, good. So as we look now, we go back to Leduc, that Canada Cup. Rachel Holman won that first ticket. So Scotty's winner, who will that be? If it should be Rachel Holman. And who gets that spot at the end of the curling season come the end of April, early May. They will look at the total points and the points leader of this particular season will get that spot. I would just rather throw more weight. Okay. Just push and it just to keep sure playing. Down normal? You don't know, even if you don't win the event, you need to win. You mind. might get it another mm -hmm. way through the tour points. Just about perfect. It just didn't curl at the end for Krista there. And interesting, you know, we talk about these numbers brought to you by New Holland, proud sponsor of Curling Canada. So Holman being out curled. We talk about a plus, a plus one, a plus two rather. If you out curl your opponent by five percentage points or more, you're given a plus. Like being on the goal for an uh, on the ice for a goal or a, a goal scored against. No, no. She's plus nine to th this week. Close. That's how yeah, well yeah. she has played. Is it? Right now, oh. though, she's being out yeah, oh. yep. yeah, Plus nine is outstanding. Well, she's getting a lot of help from Emma too. Emma's having a really good, solid game. She ever outplaying Kendra. Fraction higher. But Call. Okay, 10, 10 and a half. Yep. Right. Got this. This is a, a must make. Sit right there when you're facing three. Nervous all the way down. That's 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, nice to be back in Moose Jaw, second time after the Scotties of 2015. And for Jones won that year. That was title number five for her. Subsequently went on to win a sixth, and she's still in the field as Team Wildcard will be in the uh, one-two page playoff coming up later tonight against Manitoba. So Northern Ontario get the single to take the lead, and we go to the ninth. Ontario will have the last rock. They have the hammer playing the red stone. First, when you look at that yellow, it's just barely out of the free, or in the free guard zone, out of the rings. Rachel went open side. Northern Ontario countered with the second guard, so now it's game on. And no line, no line. Holman can go for a two or a three is one option here. Was it intended, Cheryl, to go that deep with the first one from uh, Lisa Weagle down to the back 12? Uh, oh, on the right hand side. Yeah. Yes, it was. They don't want to leave T liner better, so you don't leave an easy hit and roll in behind the center. Okay. And that one she leaves just top edge of the four. That's perfect. Top These are. This is always the interesting end because Krista is trying so hard to force. Mm -hmm. 
But you're ignoring stones, specifically Lisa's first one. I think Rachel went open side, assuming Northern Ontario would hit it. And then, <laughs> as you said, get the blank. No and now, all of a sudden, they're sitting two already. Line's good. Yeah, Krista has another plan. Might have to curl a little. Can't really bounce right now. Line's OK. Yeah, but you can't bounce. Kendra, if you can. Yep, Kendra's rock. No Definitely bounce. Kendra. No bounce. No bounce. Yep, go, go. Yep, hard. Yep, yep. hard, 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 hard. hard. Good shot. Good shot. Yeah, yeah, great corner. Judging. So your Northern Ontario game plan here to on force okay. one, take the last rock in a tie game. So do we expect we if you're Northern have. Ontario to put every rock in play, trying to okay. junk things up and keep it complicated here? Yeah, within reason. That's yeah. the problem is you do that and you're ignoring yeah. stones, which they're doing right now. You have to make sure like that last one, perfect angle. That already negates that uh, Lisa Wigglestone in the wings. Very much about rock positioning so you don't give up a bundle. So using that little stagger now, Russ, to go right around? I think they're trying to go on top, I think, and, or, or maybe okay. just jiggle them around. All right. Are we nine? Nine, ten. Gotta go. Gotta curl. Hard, Lise! Hard, Lise! Definitely gonna jiggle it here. Hard! Hard! And that unlocks it. And then pushes it out into the open. Yeah, yeah. Roll behind these. Well, okay. That's okay. I think that's all right. Yeah. Like bump? Sure. Okay. Okay. You got it, Ash. Roll behind the T line and don't set up that red yellow combo. Like roll right behind that those staggers to the right side of the button. Would be the really good spot. Otherwise, you hard, leave a red hard, uh, run double. Hard, hard. Get... Whoa, 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 yes, yes, hard, yes, hard. 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 Now trying to roll it a little bit more and very nice. Not quite as far, Cheryl, as they wanted to go. Maybe a little further into the forefoot on the left to avoid that short run on those two staggers there. Yeah, I don't, th I think it's gone. They played a simple as low on the uh, board for them. She's at 78%, but everyone else is in the 80s and better. Uh, maybe he didn't roll far enough. Yeah, I think I you think still, still have, yeah. yeah. I think it's still there. Just another few inches, and this is not there at all. You talking yeah. some drag here? If they could get to the nose, it'll drag for sure, but they can't get to the nose. It's uh, If they high side it thin, it, it will miss, I believe. So they're, uh, this is really smart. They're going to soften the weight to get closer to the nose. Join Courtney at just 71%. Yep, hard. Really hard, up. Really hard. Gotta go. Hard. Can it find that one? They, oh, they did. Can you get to the nose? Yes, they did. Go, go, go. And it'll drag and touch the shot rock on the way by. Oh. That was a great call and great execution. I can't actually believe they got to the nose. Inside nose. Otherwise, that drag wasn't going to be there. No. Really nice shot. Now staggered the other way. Can't do anything there. I don't think. No. Okay. Yep. Still not too bad I for Northern know. Ontario. Yeah, we like that. Go around. Yep. Like draw. Yep. To the yeah, button. Right? Yep. Yeah, I think this is the shot. Yeah. Okay. Tricky raise. You can't raise the top nice red, Cheryl. Right. You can maybe yes. raise the one in the eight foot, but on on it at a forty-five degree angle. I don't think uh, Rachel expected that kind of curl because she yep, line. Line you knows her Best own, line. then you don't get that in. But, it, but they got an inside roll line. actually on that last one, Where which left hard. this stagger. Four, back four, hard, yep, tapping, hard. Playing the raise now. Oh. Yes, okay. go, 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 go. We do have enough. We can yep, probably yep, get yep, it. Yep, do you yep, have go, enough? How much is left in that stone? Oh, oh nothing, no. nothing. Well, the 3-4 winner will move on to the semifinal tomorrow. Tonight's game at 7 Eastern time, the 1-2 page playoff, the winner right through to tomorrow's final. Carrie Anderson, Manitoba, Jennifer Jones, six-time champion, Team Wildcard, 7 p.m. Eastern time. And reminder, it happens after our curling.
Day in Canada special, which comes your way at 5 p.m. Eastern or immediately following our coverage of this 3-4 page playoff. What a great opportunity now. Yeah, it's pretty messy in front. It is, and anything locked around there, there's no way to get at it. If that tender had been a little lighter, there, that five, yellow would have five. popped out and they could have tapped it up. Oh, now it's hurting them. It's really good. It's really close. Gotta, gotta go, be here. Gotta go. Can't be deep. It's really hard. Please. Gotta go, dig. Hard. hard dig. Hard, hard, please. Anything they've hard. got. Again, hard. anything hard. you've keep got going, left. Going, oh my gosh, it's just digging in yeah. and they drag it for all it's worth. They are not the shot stone, however. That is still that yellow rock that's sitting in the open hard. at the back eight. Hard, please. Push. Hard. Hard. Pretty good hard. miss, though. Hard. Keep going, keep going, keep going. So what do you do now if you're McCarvel? Yeah. And how far out do you go? Would you go other turn for the come around? Because you're stacking these two yellows together if this doesn't bury. And then Rachel's sitting about five. You know, they always talk about the Christmas tree. Look what we got there. <laughs> That's it. That's the best example of the Christmas tree. Yeah, Colleen Jones. Yeah. Not much more. I really like the other turn here. And you can even go back to your own and sit two. It's really tough to put this in a good spot. Mine's good. Mine's good. Make sure. Got to be there. It's 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 out in the good stuff. This will glide. There it goes. Yep, yep. Yeah, but what about the double? Oh dear. Oh, and back it yeah, goes. Yeah. Okay. But they are sitting the two at the moment. Every time they go wider, they're heavy. Sorry? Oh, I don't know what to do. Just trying to get the double on this. This isn't great. But if I stay like higher. What was your coming. first thought? She's probably coming right around. Hmm? She's probably coming right around. Yeah. It's not easy. We can follow. It's not easy. It's just their shot two right now. So I'm wondering if we... Try topping this? Yeah. Okay. How much? Like, we can even try and throw, like, yeah. a hack. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Okay. Yeah, kind of come around the horn. You might come back up a bit with your. It's, it's you want to hit them because then you'll be probably lane three, but you're going to be behind the tee line. So you'd like your shooter out of there a bit. I thought the, uh, yeah. I thought the tap on the red as we look at it on the left side might mm -hmm. be a play for sure. Yeah, that works too. The only thing I don't love about that is. You kind of take away having access at these two yellow. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're, they've got the whole forefoot blocked up both ways. I think you have no, to try to sit two or three here. Close. Yeah, we or at least kill easy. one of them. Mm -hmm. Close. No. Coming down. No. He's good. Am I off? Joe. Really got to go, Joe. Really got to go. Hard! Now off one, off two, and back up. Oh, goodness. What a shot. Sitting for Shot Rock. It, you couldn't throw that any no, better. Dude. You don't roll like that, and you're wide open for backing to draw down to. And in fact, look, when you when it finally settles, now those two stones at the top, really gotta go, those Joe. two really right there go. on the edge Hard. of the eight, they come into play, and sitting, it appears three. Just, it's the weight on that call. Brilliant. Just brilliant. Whew. She's yeah. having a game. That was the problem with Chris, with Krista like calling that. that uh, here, yeah. right? Kendra going around the same side There's and stocking right up the now. two yellows. They could have gone the other turn. There wouldn't have been a double. Yeah, time out. Emma Miskew is the best player on the ice at 90%. Yeah. It's, uh, she's been making some incredible shots. Timeout. Mm -hmm. Has been called. Can we yeah. ever tap that? Yeah, by Northern just Ontario. Say. That works. That, that's that's saw. what's the get it a jail shot was... here, I think. Tap yeah, that yellow. High side on the left. Yeah. Yeah. Good things happen if you hit it, you know, half weightish, board weight or backline weight. Uh, 
um, a little yeah, less. Yeah, you go close to half. Close no, to half. Less, half. There's there. two options. The oats can come around. If you get even freeze our back one, it kind of kills those two, yeah. and we could try to force them to two. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Hold them to two at this yeah. point. Try That's a great shot because if you, you could throw a hack at that. Yeah. I yeah, yeah. can see half of it, right? Yeah, yeah I can so see half. This, yeah. this isn't bad though. Like, I You'd have to throw weight at this. Well, you'll probably like, always have that. If you even, at least, yeah, I think I don't this. mind this. I do too. Because so, you could even come off this a little bit. Too. What, Rick? You don't want to line those up, but if you if you throw that, I think you've got to throw like half weight because you have to direct it yeah. into yeah. this one, yeah. right? Okay. So this. Yeah. It's a saving shot. They're going to run still, but it might open up something for your last one to get in there, right? Oh. I like it. Two that choices they talked about coming down, down this way is which they really should have done last shot, not set up that double. Or, and the one they're going to yeah. pick here, as Rick says, throw a little extra yeah. weight here because if you tick that one or tick that one, it's going right in this direction. And then they always could, as he said, to Russ, if you need to, then you'll play that one down to the back. Yes. As their last shot, if needed. Yeah, it's going to be needed. <laughs> And I like Rick's call on the weight because you know it's coming off something mm -hmm. with the angle and how much they can see of this one. So pack weight. Yeah, the only unlucky one is if you feather the top red and still goes through the port. Tough shot. We're, we're looking right at it. You can see the very small half. These hack waiters, we've talked about them all week. They can track on you. You almost have to hit. A little less than what you see. Even get it in for second buried would be a huge accomplishment. So now again they hold it. They've got to get it by their own whoa, whoa. center guard first. Kendra Lowe, a line call. Whoa, Gates whoa, helping whoa, this whoa, over whoa, now. Whoa, get it by whoa, that whoa. one and then touch that one. Yep. Tick, 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 yep, tick. Yep, yep, Where's yep, it going to go? Oh, and it'll spin up to the top four and shot rock Northern Ontario. Was that not incredible? Oh, just, just special. Called and made. Looked like it was going to hit it thin and not go very far, Cheryl, but when the yellow one hits it, it spins. Double spins off both reds. Touch one, touch two. Here we go. That's a double gear effect. <laughs> there you go. Oh. But if she does that. Taps. She's shot right now. Yeah. yeah. Or we just like play it. Incredible. It's just so thin, I think we're going to roll yeah. and make a pocket. Mm. Okay. Do you like hack? Yeah. And try and chisel sideways? Yeah. I need at least hack to get it to move. Yeah. Okay. Hack weight. Now those reds that Holman left there on that uh, when they played that hit roll on the left hand side are actually causing them. That's the cover, isn't it? The brilliant part about that previous shot is if this is made properly, you've got two in there. But to do it, you're rolling away and that opens up the entire intern side. And then we always have something on your last. That's interesting. Well, I think that's yeah. what Emma's worried about. You make the angle raise. Okay, have this and something over here. Especially if you don't make the angle raise. Yeah. You could hit your own out for the same price. She's trying to unlock their stagger. Good and idea. Give them two ways. It, Smart call. Foot and roll to here. Yeah, she probably makes this though, eh? I touched that. I don't think I moved it very far. I just nicked my foot. So do you like um, an 11? Is that okay. what you're thinking? I just, I was thinking a little less. Like I was thinking just like up here and change the angle. I'm just worried if I don't tap it far enough then I block this off. Okay. Like, so that's why I was thinking like not even tap That it. way if I'm 11 and I over curl and I chisel this and, and open some stuff up. Okay. I, I think if I'm too light, we could, uh, we could handcuff ourselves, right? Yeah, 11 on the six. I like yeah. Emma's yeah. call. I like Rachel's weight. You underthrow mm -hmm. this and you just leave another right. stagger. Make sure you get your shooter to roll yes. off. Yeah, the idea is to, to uh, take away the stagger so the, the heavier you are, the better chance you have of doing that. They've got lots of raises. I'm just going to run. 11? 
If you move that top red, you've got two raises, in turn and out turn, and uh, Krista can't take them both away. I'll be back 12. Okay. Lisa Weagle will try to help this over, try to get it just right now. Hold it now, bump it back. Oh, and bumps it too far. They're sitting second and third, but Shot Rock still belongs to Northern Ontario. Oh, but look what they left. Red run on the left, red run on the right. So they, they, they get out of jail. He's come down here with the yellow. It's not easy, and this is starting to curl a little more, but if they could ever get it to there, Cheryl. If. Yes, we can do that. Okay, T-line, freeze them. Okay. okay. It's nice out here. Real nice out here. Okay. They've, they've realized it's quicker out here. Now, it's, can they keep it out, get it past that rock in the eight foot? Rachel got a little unlucky there, just, just yeah. kicked it out. But it's still, it's edge on the edge. This is difficult to get to the nose. You want to be closer than the rock you're freezing to. Well, the last bit of curl oh, has to, is probably a foot, I'm foot good. and a half to get underneath. Sip a lot of curl on the brush. Go, Here we go. go Kendra go, Lilly go, calling go, line. Go, go, that stone's go, coming go, up go, top go, eight. Got to wrap it around that one. Now help it over again, Gates. Can you get to the inside? Get to the nose, get across the nose, push it back, okay. and they may have oh, just you. done enough to be the third shot. And even then, I don't Great know. Wait. Good. Sorry, we could have come off a little longer. It's it's have a it. Double. Quarter off. Red. Oh, for sure. Yellow, yellow, double. Oh, even yeah. if we just, it just I, rolls like the there. The air, three. I thought it was. Yeah. Quarter yeah. off. Freeze would have been better, but how, what else do you ask for? They, they they knew they weren't going to get to the inside, so they had to bump it to sit second. Which they had to be second, so now you just hope. This is here all day. Feel? You can see it all, eh? Yeah. Should we be able to drag it out? Yeah. And keep it there, no? Yeah, how have you been throwing them? That's four. Third close four. to. Yeah, I like a third. You just know she's going to be close on this one. Taking she, negative ice we're right behind it. This this doesn't curl. Third, she's wrecking third. on the long guard. Well, she effectively just threw this on her last yep. one. It was just half weight and didn't sweep. do a thing. Okay. She had a good sense of the spot where to put the broom. Three quarters high. Okay, let's make it. Very tight ice, but Rachel's out turn with, with peel weight where they can track it back out there. Just a hair high side here. It's yeah. her shot. Whoa. It's yes. in her playbook. Whoa. Courtney, Weagle. Courtney, Weagle. Miss Q got one, bump it, and far enough. Right. For one, two, and three. Being out curled in the game so far. And then comes through with a big shot when needed most. Ontario gets three. Deleted by a couple coming home. Big three by Ontario. In that ninth, has them up by a couple. As we go to 10, Northern Ontario with last drop playing the Yellowstone. And when you look at that scoreboard, what did we say? You know, the difficulty that Ontario had had scoring multiple points with the last drop. They were 0 and 4 until they scored two in seven. And then now they've gotten a three with the last rock in nine. So an explosion for them with five points in the last three ends.
Nothing ever. Okay, the two and seven was caused by a couple of rocks sliding right deep for Northern Ontario, and that's exactly what happened in that end there. And uh, pull marks to Rachel Holm, and I think more to Emma mm -hmm. for calling, uh, unlocking that staggered situation and giving her two shots. And it's like you know how to weave here because that's exactly it. When you go to that seventh, and it was a Carvel's draw. Yeah which was heavy setting up the deuce and then what a wonderful shot by Holman the raise double for three and Rachel Holman still being out curled but uh, who looks at that now when you look at the scoreboard 7-5 Ontario the game story brought to you by Tim Hortons the official coffee of curling Canada we were just saying in the break that you know Krista's only other option on her last one was just freeze, not get second mm -hmm. shot, and then that's probably the only thing you've got there would be for two at the right. very outside. So yeah, two would have been a lot better. Oh. They only swept it away from the freeze to they were trying to tap it to sit the two, and they probably didn't need to. You're right, just just try to lock it on there. Oh, she it's made a over here. Yep. fantastic shot with her first one. Yep. Let's say uh, back twelve. Okay, yeah. back line, back twelve. Yep. Okay. Well, besides the, the line call or, or the call to open things up, the stagger up on Emma's, it's the shot she made where she spun up into the back. Right. That was the a beauty. The uh, back line double. Yeah. <laughs> roll up and. Through. Yeah, that's yep. great. Yeah. Emma's played exceptionally well. Yep. Hard. Whoa. Hard. 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 Try to Hard. angle it back Hard. and roll Hard. over Hard. if they can. Hard. And roll over, tuck a little bit in behind. Lovely. Very, very nice. Oh, they finally made one on that side. Great shot. They've tried multiple <laughs> times to get the roll behind those corners. And there's the double on that yeah. side. There's the one on the Scotty's box. Yeah. There's one just in front of the Scotty's and one in the 12. Gosh, they brought her weight down there a little bit and allowed it to hang around. So Northern Ontario looking for the two to tie, three to win, and Ontario knows. Last night they gave up a couple of threes early to Manitoba. Uh. Well, this is looking very good for Northern Ontario for at the very least a deuce. One behind the corner and this uh, shot here could tap back, freeze on top of shot stone. Shot Rock is on the lid. Ashley Sipple. It'll slow down here. Oh, they lost it. Picked. Yikes. And they can't use that now. Now it's a stagger covering Shot Rock. I oh, hate to see that. Um, I don't mind normal if we're just gonna okay. roll I'll over. Roll up normal, just make sure. Well, if we're normal, I could try and go pretty thin. Okay. Whatever you like. Okay, up normal. Sure. You better make a decision before you throw it. The Scotty's necklace around the neck of Emma yep. Miscue. And the diamonds that go with it for all the appearances. And away goes the corner guard. Great game from Emma Miskew. Yeah, she's at, still high on the ice at 90%. Take a move it a bit. Straight freeze? I thought or do we ever? I thought you were just going to, we don't have any shots. Do we ever kind of do like a hack, bump and roll off the red? Try to spill that one in maybe? Yeah, and try to or roll and guard not. ours. Sure. I don't know, just we're never going to. Yeah, we're never we're, gonna let's try that. it. Do you like that? Sure. So we're going to have to tick and roll to there. Okay. Yeah. So probably like firm half. Sure. Okay. okay. Do you guys like this? We'll it's a really it good here. call. So just, you know, you're oh, going to get, try and get two yellows yeah. in the rings, okay. open up shot good. stone, yeah. roll for a corner. <laughs> Better than my plan. Yeah. Kendra Lilly. Solid hat. Jen, really hard, Jen. 
Shen Gates trying to catch enough now to push it and roll in, but not enough. And through it will go. Well, at least they're unlocked. Yeah, that's the other thing, I guess. Uh, they're, they're unlocked. But they're trying to save yellows. Did its own T line at that. Ended up with a couple of yellow corners. Really bad Sorry. luck, though, too, because I thought they'd actually maybe rub their stone in the 12 foot and at least keep it around. Yeah, that's what I mean. That's why I over curl it a little. Okay, okay. So this same is nice good area. speed here? Yep. You might want to give you last time so too much. Or do you think because that's what's really Hard fun. to over curl it, isn't that's it? Yeah, yeah, I think really so. Quick. It's really quick, yeah. The other turn would have been easier. And it curls more, too. Wait, it's really close. Could go a bit. Okay, line's good. 75% overall. Yeah. Was Kendra Lilly. Top yes. four. We great. Yep. Yes. yes. Hard ash. Boy, it's T moving at that center through. guard. Close. All there. Jen. All there. If Bump they in. can sneak go, it. Go now. And now go, watch go, it bend. Can go, you go, get go, across go. the nose? Okay. Yeah, no, you can't. Okay, yeah, I don't think it was there. Okay. Great effort. It's a call, right? Heel. You just don't want to like just chisel and stay. Let's just go this way. How are you throwing this? That's nothing, eh? Now. Yeah. She happens to just peel it. Is there any point in running? No, if we like happen to clip, clip our own. Okay. Oh, uh, the, the reason, reasonable head there from Emma Miskew. Let's, let's just get rid of it. No, no need to run it. Yeah, you make this, you're going to wide open hit to guarantee an extra in with last stone. The voice of reason. There you go. And timeout being called by McCarville and Northern Ontario. Rick Lang. Top eight around. Yeah, yeah. Top eight? There. She's going to have to make a play on this. Just a reminder, Hopefully curlling day in Canada. One of our specials right coming here. up. Well, she does, but we're desperate at this point. You might have a, a what? A, a run with the one you just shot. Or are you trying to bury that? No, we're going to bury it, yeah, yeah I think. Bury. It's just top eight? Even over bury. Yeah, over bury a little yeah. bit. You might have a thing in if yeah. she does something, right? Okay. There's okay. no, I don't think there's a good play on the four unless you split it back yeah. and then your risk getting it over there. It's going to be wide open here anyway. Okay. That's a good shot, too. It's just a lot riskier. Yeah. They're, they're talking about there. What about yeah. here? Yeah. They're saying they have to bury it. Sure. What if you Christmas treat it? And then if Rachel goes for the back one and never jams it, by burying it, she's going to sit two or at least, at least like there's a zero chance of a three. Mm -hmm. Like we're going in a different path. And we haven't quite gone right across here, but I can't imagine it being much if different. You, Bury an inch, there's no yellow double. I know we just said we haven't actually gone across the middle, but I think. I think I like a hair more. I think it would be similar. Okay. Yeah, we should be pretty similar here. Yeah. <laughs> you gotta go, Ash. Picked up very early yep. by Mine's Gates good. and Cipolla. Yep. Top eight. Mine's good. We yep. did. We yep. don't line only. Oh. Room. Starting to go and the way will come down. Jen. 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 Yep. Go. Go. Gotta go, Jen. Go. 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 Good. 
to the top eight. It's not like they were going to chase that though, Cheryl. No. Yeah, great shot again. Just threw down normal. Okay, you like that? Yep. Yeah, she's had a great game. I mean, she really made her last one in the last end too. Mm -hmm. And a, maybe the shot of the week with the first one. <laughs> A little tap, double rub for shot. Still out curling, uh, Rachel Holman. Krista McCarvel at 81%. the two and underneath somewhere she has struggled and reached down and found something and has played a magnificent game the last three ends you don't see that often Vic usually goes the other way it's just a downhill slide a really good brushing by Joe to get enough Remember, if that had been there, that shot wasn't available. So now it's straight back onto there. Try to make the double. Wow. And hold it. And your run, your raise stone has to stick right yeah. there as well. Yeah, it's not sure it's there. If anybody can make it, it's Krista. Krista yep. McCarville. Final stone. Yes. Has an opportunity. Oh. Trails by a couple. Can you hold this? Can you run this back? Okay. No, you'll run it by. And Ontario will pick up a couple of more. And now that six straight wins for Holman over Northern Ontario in the Scotties make the final nine to five. And the three time champion will advance again for the second straight year out of the 3-4 page playoff. And they'll be on to Sunday's semifinal and they await the winner of tonight's 1-2 page, Manitoba or Team Wildcard. Oh, and disappointment for McCarvel again out of Thunder Bay, hoping that she might where that maple leaf when the Scotties goes to Thunder Bay oh, next year. The Scotties Tournament of Hearts is brought to you by OK Tire and BKT Tires. The Scotties Tournament of Hearts is brought to you by Tim Hortons, the official coffee of Curling Canada, by Purex Bathroom Tissue, soft and absorbent for over 95 years, and by Home Hardware. Here's how. As a little kid, I dreamed of maybe playing in one Scotties, and here we are, I think it's 15, and we've won six, and I just would like to go out and play well with our team, and we've worked really hard, and. It would be great to have an opportunity to maybe make that final. Oh, it would mean so much. A win for Team Manitoba, Kerry Anderson. Just dreaming about representing Canada one day, and it's just, I think everyone dreams about this. Well, trying to make that dream come true, Anderson and Jones tonight. When we join you at 7 p.m. Eastern time, the winner right through to Sunday's final. The loser knows that we'll have a date with Team Ontario and Rachel Holman tomorrow. So that's when we join you again at 7 p.m. Eastern Time. Stay with us. This is Curling Day in Canada. And Brian is standing by along with Bob Weeks to showcase this wonderful sport in this country and all right here on Canada's Sports Leader, TSN.